Bobby Golden, I work at the Delta Research and Extension Center at Mississippi State University in Stoneville, Mississippi. And we're standing in some of our soybean plots where we're evaluating ESN as a nitrogen addition. We've been working with ESN since 2003. This is the third year of soybean trials that, that we've been working on here, uh, specifically looking at additions at two application timings, V4 and R1. To, to see if we can boost already high yield potential in soybeans. So these soybeans are generally going to be above 75 bushel beans to begin with, and we feel like we might need an extra boost to take us to the next level. So we're determining the appropriate end rate, if one exists, to get us to the next level. Our current results with, with the preliminary year and then one full year of, of the trial we're standing in this year, we're averaging about a 6% yield increase when we apply at least 40 units of nitrogen. The crop safety aspect that we see with the ESN, where we're going to use the ESN generally here in the Mid-South is going to be in those same areas where we would use urea. We see because of our high humidity and our leaf wetness, a lot of uh, foliar injury from top dress urea applications to corn when the whirl is open. And uh, we've seen uh, a little bit to a great deal better in the crop safety when we use ESN over top depending on those environmental conditions. So under the wet conditions here in the Mid-South is where we see ESN perform the best. And generally on our corn soils that are very sandy that we're planting early in March, within the first week of March to the second week of March, we get the most benefit out of ESN in that scenario as opposed to if we were planting in April when we've missed the large window for a lot of that early season rain that could leach or potentially denitrify uh, that nitrogen that we've applied. So there's a couple favorite parts to my job. As a scientist, you always are inquisitive. You always want to find the next thing. You always are looking to, to be very learned to what's going on in the plant, but probably that that's excites me but what I get the most satisfaction out of is when we can go to a guy's farm that may have a problem and we can uh, establish ourselves on that farm, identify that problem, fix it and put dollars back in his pocket.